Hey guys, it's Jay Cat down the road here. Okay, so tonight I have something special planned for you. I am going to pierce my cheeks. Hey, okay, so what I'm gonna do first is um, clearly I'm cleaning them with alcohol and uh, I'm gonna remark my marks because for whatever, you know. Okay, so my mirror is here and I actually have my chat room crew live with me. So, Let's get this done. Okay, so that is how I have them marked. They're not necessarily dimple piercings, they're just as much as they are cheek piercings. So I don't know what you would call it, they're just a little closer to my mouth. Plus I feel like that's going to be the least painful spot to stick a needle. So, okay, here we go. Without further ado. All right, so I've cleaned my face. I have marked my spots, which, I don't know. I don't know if I really like that one. I kind of don't like that one. Oh, I can't get a friggin' marker open. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I've got the approval from my fans, and now we get the needle. So this is what we're using. We are using a 12 gauge needle. Okay, and I'm going to use these magic little clamps that everybody loves so much because they're so awesome. Slippery. <clears throat> and these clamps I'm not going to clamp all the way so uh, my piercing teacher taught me to put a rubber band around the clamp to kind of hold it steady but since I got mine wet now it's actually too wet. Okay. So hopefully that won't happen. Now um, as far as this video goes I'm just going to go ahead and say disclaimer, I am not currently licensed um, to, like, I'm not licensed, I'm not working in a shop, uh, I am doing this at home, um, I do know what I'm doing, but I would not recommend that any of you try this at home, do not try this at home, okay, uh, this has to be done by a professional, I just happen to be a professional and I'd be happy to do this myself, so... Um, yeah, don't try this at home, kids. And, um, I don't really know what else to say, like, in, I don't really know what to say in these videos, like, what do you say? Like, I don't know. But anyway, if you like the video, feel free. Um, what I'm going to do today is going to be a little gruesome. Okay. So, um, uh, first off. We get a little bit of anti ointment that is going to lubricate our needles. You literally only need like a dab. Um, 
And then I have this really long libre ring that's gonna go right in. So I'm gonna put the needle through the outside and push it back out the outside. So that's that's basically how this is going to work. Um, since I'm doing a 14 gauge piercing, and that's the size that I'm going to be using, I use a 12 gauge needle because my piercing will slide right in the end and it makes for a much easier piercing. So, um, Sammy is back here behind me and I am going to depend on him and Chuck, hopefully, if I start to faint or fall, that hopefully they'll catch me. Um, but yeah, so let's get started. Um, I got my needle out, which these needles are really cool. Um, I think the place he said he bought it from was like, oh, I, I don't know, I'll get a link to it and put it in the description box below. Um, but it's got these like fancy, like little tubes on the end of their piercing needles. Mine always just come with foam balls. Like, foam ball. Okay, so basically what I'm doing is I'm rubbing my needle through my ointment, through my heavy ointment to, to lubricate the needle. And then I am going to take a little too much lubrication. <laughs> you can't wrap too much. No. <laughs> no, no, no. no. <laughs> so <coughs> I'm going to clamp off my cheek. Uh, typically, I don't use clamps. Like, if I do a piercing, like, if I can't just hold my skin and do it, um, I won't do it, but since I want to make sure these are straight and even and go like directly in because your mouth is concave, so you want your piercings to go at an angle, typically a 45 degree angle, um, because if you put them straight in, they're going to be like pinching. If you put them straight in that way, it's not going to work right. So you basically have to go in at a 45 degree angle as your best bet. So, um, oh, I hate that my camera is like so big right now. I totally want to like shrink this out just a little. Ooh, okay. Okay. Oh, hello, hello, hello. All right. Now I just change my gloves because I just touched the camera. Boop. The gloves. Okay. So. That's a much better angle, right? Totally better. I like this angle much better. Uh, but when I go to do the actual piercing, I don't know how I'm actually gonna get up close and personal with you. It's just like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've made pretty big marks. The needles I'm using are pretty big, so I'm just kind of hoping they'll go where I'm wanting them to can go and not mess up. Pardon my language, ladies. Okay, but for real, if your grandma's watching me, like, that is not my fault. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay, so here we go. I'm going to clamp off. And then what do I need to do? I need to get ready to slide the needle through, put the piercing in, and just make sure, like, I'm sure that this will work the way I want it to. But yes, okay. So, I'm going to put the needle in, pull the jewelry back out, put the ball on. That's the fucking plan, man. I don't know if it's going to work. We're going to fucking see. Excuse all the fuckings. I am just showing the, diver the diversity of the word. Okay. I'm going to stop fucking around now. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Now, I don't know how this is going to work. <sighs> Fuck! My adrenaline's already rushing.
Oh my god. I hate these fucking walls. Oh my god. Okay, there's one down. And I don't know if I really like that it's sitting out, actually. I don't know. But we'll be right back. Hey guys, I'm back. Okay, actually, it's only been like 10 minutes. But, like, okay, so I took a minute, took a breather. <sighs> All right, now, got the next needle ready. I've got my next barbell ready. <laughs> And we are going to do the other cheek. Um, I can already kind of feel this one swelling. And it almost feels like it has me stuck in a perpetual smile. Like, kind of like how the Joker would feel, I think. So, I'm down with that. Down with that. I do apologize for all the cussing. For all the parents that see this video. I apologize for all the cussing. I'm sure that you can understand why. Okay. Oh, I thought you were going to be, I was like, what did I do? No, I'm recording right now. Just so you guys know. Sam, did you know I'm recording, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Okay, so here we go. I'm gonna get ready to clamp off. I'm using the mirror in front of me, so forgive me if it's a weird angle or a bad angle. Sucks, I know. I'm gonna get the clamp comfortable for the barrel to sit directly at a 45 degree angle. I'm going to insert my jewelry. Okay, and we are in, and I think we're cooking, but 
That's it. Who cares? I went in the stupid hole. And if it's screwed up, I can just fix it later. Anyway. So, this is how it came out. And I will give you an update. I'm sure tomorrow I'm going to be look, looking like a chipmunk. Um, but yeah, everything went great. Um, I really like them. I'm happy. Everything went really well. There we go. any excess ink now for aftercare always rinse after every cigarette after every meal after every drink and I don't mean like every sip I mean like after every fucking drink like when the drink's done like go fucking clean your mouth just keep it clean um mm, but we will see how everything goes I think they came out pretty decent, like, I was showing all my fans, so, because my chat room is live, so, they get to all see it. Um, actually, this is just a chat room that I hang out in, one of the most, uh, it's called Celebrity Status, and it is owned by Cash, um, uh, and a there's some more people on there under the name, but Cash is the main guy. He made the room. I think he's the owner of the room, um, and he's cool as shit. So he let me do this live on his chat room tonight, so I want to say thank you for that, Cash. Um, and, uh, yeah, it's all good. Um, piercing is not what most people think it is, and I think if you have the right mindset and you're ready for it, um, I don't think this is such a problem as a lot of people just assume. So, um, I am going to cut you guys off because I do have to get back to my friends. Um, but I will come back. I will see you later. I'll give you an update. Um, I'm still doing my tongue tying, so I got a few different mods going on at the same time, but I think it's okay. I feel pretty quick and I'm pretty clean about everything. So, um, anyway, yeah, that's it. That's all I have for you tonight. And, uh, Thanks for sticking around this long if you have. I know this has been a super, uber, duper long video. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to show you guys my great skills. Thank you so much. And um, yeah, so I'll probably be doing, um, I don't know what my next video will be about. We'll talk about that tomorrow. But for tonight, I think I'm just going to go drink a beer and have a great night. You guys do the same. Love you. Peace, love, and harmony.